Hey everyone, Sourcegraph 4.0 is a big step forward for developers everywhere because Sourcegraph is becoming not just code search, but a code intelligence platform. Code search just helps you find matching lines in code, but code intelligence helps you find answers about code so that you can get unblocked faster and stay in flow while coding. Since we started Sourcegraph in 2013, there's a lot more code, devs, and complexity everywhere. And just like our customers and their code bases, we've grown a lot over the years. Today, more than 1.8 million developers have indexed 283 billion lines of code on Sourcegraph to understand, fix, and automate across all of their code. Our customers now include four out of five of the FANG companies, four of the top 10 US banks, the large Hadron Collider team at CERN, and so many other awesome companies that build the software that we use in our everyday lives. And along with code search, we built some other primitives to help with these big code problems. Batch changes to make large scale code changes and refactors to pay down tech debt and fix security problems and code insights to see trends in code, such as the progress of a big migration or how a platform team's new API or library is being adopted. Sourcegraph 4.0 is about tying this all together to become a code intelligence platform, helping you find not just matching lines in code, but answers in code. This makes Sourcegraph more useful, more times per day to every single dev. We can't wait to show you everything in 4.0. And to start off, I'll hand it over to Maria Craig, a product manager here at Sourcegraph. Sourcegraph 4.0 introduces over a dozen updates, and our first focus is on the core workflow of our code intelligence platform, making it more useful, more often. As developers, we don't only really care about finding things in our code, we also care about drawing insights from our code. The first thing you'll notice is a refreshed search UI. It's less cluttered, more intuitive, and less distracting. We designed code search to keep you in flow, so it's critical for the code search interface to support keeping you focused. Code navigation is also a core part of the code search experience. It gives you a deeper understanding of how code works and how it's interconnected. That's why we now have precise code navigation for nine different languages. So you can jump to definitions and find references with compile level accuracy. In 4.0, we've introduced precise code navigation for Ruby and Rust, expanding our features to more code bases than ever. We've also introduced auto indexing. So now you can set up precise code navigation in just a couple of minutes. To help you better understand your code base, we've built Code Insights directly into search results. Code Insights help you track metrics from your actual code. And now, when you run a search, you can easily see these metrics. For example, you can search for log4j and see how frequently each version is used in a repos. This would have previously taken a lot of time to search for in a code base, but now it only takes a couple of seconds. 4.0 also helps you improve your entire code base in high leverage ways. Last year, we introduced batch changes, which lets you make changes across your entire code base to keep your code up to date and fix security issues. Batch changes has proved invaluable for making code base wide changes, but our first iteration required you to run changes locally. We wanted to make batch changes more accessible to new users and more scalable for large changes. In 4.0, you can now run batch changes server side rather than running them from your local machine and CLI. You can run them without setting up any local environments, so you can get started in minutes and the changes themselves run off of dedicated compute instances, so they can scale to enterprise code bases. This feature is in beta for all users. And with that, I'd like to hand it over to my teammate, Ryan Phillips. As Quinn said, we're building Sourcegraph to help millions of developers around the world work more efficiently. And Maria shared the improvements coming in 4.0 to help developers who use Sourcegraph every single day. We're also introducing improvements for admins to make it easier to deploy, configure, and maintain Sourcegraph. Upgrading Sourcegraph can be a time-intensive process, especially if you fall a few versions behind. We're introducing multi-version upgrades, an improvement to the upgrade experience that helps you jump all the way to the latest version of Sourcegraph. With 4.0, we're introducing new analytics to help you understand how developers at your company use Sourcegraph and easily quantify how much time they're saving. These analytics show the exact usage of your Sourcegraph instance, so you can see which features are most used. Plus, we know that security and privacy are critical, so we've designed the processing to happen within your instance, so the data stays private to you and your organization. 
We know dev teams today prioritize observability and want it all in one place. We've added open telemetry support in SourceGraph, so you'll be able to directly integrate with whatever your preferred observability solution is. And now, I'll hand it back to Quinn. Thanks, Ryan. SourceGraph 4.0 is a code intelligence platform that helps you find answers about code and stay in flow. And if you're already using SourceGraph, you can upgrade to 4.0 today, and upgrading is easier than ever before. If you're not yet using SourceGraph, SourceGraph Cloud makes it super easy to get started. It's now SOC 2 Type 2 compliant and gets you a dedicated SourceGraph instance for your company. So you can start using it on the code that you work with every day, securely and faster than ever before. No deployment needed. To get started, just head over to SourceGraph.com. And on behalf of the entire SourceGraph team, thank you. And we are so excited to get code intelligence out to you and every dev in the world. <laughs>